time is it? You know what time it is. It's time to hit that subscribe button. It's right down there. You know it's right down there. And it's time to find my Instagram, Geekly Amanda, G E E K L I Amanda, same on Twitter. And it's Crazy Amanda Rags on TikTok too. And it's time to get this movie review started. Review, but actually, it's a series review. A new Netflix, I got a pre screener for the, the series season two of Dead to Me. You know, it's got the Christina Applegate. And the first season, it was about that her husband, Christina Applegate, who's Jen in it, her husband went jogging and, and got hit by a hit and run guy. And, and it was just craziness, twists and turns. They, the, she befriended this girl, Judy, and it turns out that Judy was the one that the hit and runs. She hit and run the, the husband, but they still friends. And and Judy had a fiance who was with her at the time they did the hit and run, Steve. And then towards the end of season one, Steve shows up at Jen, Christina Applegate's house, and she t t he lands up in the pool. She done killed a woman in the pool cliffhanger. Well, let me tell you, season two starts out just where season one left off. Oh, yes, just it. it well, it starts off, you know, right after the, he was killed in kind of murky circumstances. You don't know why Jen killed him, but he showed up at her house and, and then next thing she was beating him over the head or something and he's up in the pool. And so season two started off where he's dead. He done moved from the pool to like a big freezer up in her garage. She, his car they done sta stashed in there. And her and Judy are talking, and she told Judy that he done attacked her, and she had to defend herself. And they were trying to, you know, cover it up together, have his body up in the freezer. Just like season one, let me tell you season two. Not only has jaw-dropping cliffhangers like we had in season one, but it feels like they're in every episode. It seems like every episode leaves, leaves with some kind of like, did that just happen? But like a double take of what is going on? Yes, twist and turns again. More twists and turns in season one, if that's even possible. Twist at every turn on this one. But it's also, I feel like this one, it's more about friendship. You know, you get they have the big friendship between Jen and Judy, so it's more about their growing friendship. Also, the struggles of you know single parenthood, do what Jen is dealing with and having to raise then two boys on her own without the husband, and on top of it, covering up a murder <laughs> with financial problems. I loved it. I loved. I was a big fan of season one. When season one left off, I was like, when is season? They better make a season two. And I'm gonna tell you. When season two leaves off, you're going to say the same thing. It's going to leave you with like, when is season three coming? They better have a season three. They can't leave me like this. And like season one, I mean, this is a, this is a, a, a series about murder and covering up murder and all that stuff. But it also has comedy. It also has the like the drama crime kind of thing. Where, I mean, they have detectives trying to investigate all the murders now. Like, at first it was like the Ted, the husband that was hit and run, his Ted. And now she, they have the fiance of Judy who was just, you know, well, he's missing. They don't know that murder he's missing so it's a whole thing then you're introduced to steve's family and all that kind of stuff so you get some new characters in it but i'm gonna tell you i enjoyed it i thought it was just as great as the first season uh, maybe even a little better you know if it, it depends on what you like in the season if you like those jaw dropping twist turns cliffhangers can't believe that just happened then this is not going to disappoint and you will like this one i give it a nine out of ten two thumbs up another winner from the netflix on their series another win winner in seasons for dead to me both seasons are great i highly recommend them and i hope you enjoy them too comes out tomorrow so uh, when you see it let me know what you think comments thumbs all that until next time mwah.